alive, amen, he's alive. Jesus is alive, forever he's alive, amen. He's alive, amen, he's alive. Jesus is alive, forever he's alive, amen. He's alive, amen, he's alive. Jesus is alive forever. He's alive, amen. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive forever. He's alive, amen. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive forever. He's alive, amen. He's alive, amen. Jesus is alive forever. He's alive, amen. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive forever. He's alive, amen. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive forever. Looking for a girl, she just came this way. Girl. Yeah, she was wearing a um I think a navy blue floral gown or something. Uh, oh she just left. She just left? Yeah. Like through the door? Yeah. JJ! Hey, up or now? Still watching this film? Oh no, yes yeah, so. I saw this girl at the supermarket. Super pretty. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Did you get her number? No, I didn't get her number. Oh, man. Did you at least get her name? No, no. I was going to get it, but as soon as I came out, she was already gone. Mm. Pfft, to teen air. But, emphasis on this girl is beautiful. She is. Mm. Natural beauty, beautiful lips, brown skin. Look, when Wale sang Dice Pineapples, that's the girl he was talking about. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Bro, hey, <wake> cop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine, I'm alright. But, but that girl is fine. Damn. Oh, please, I'm starving. Huh? I'm starving. Okay. You know? I miss home cooked meal. You know, meal that is made with. Love. So where are you going to get this meal? This meal with love. Where? Because last time I checked, you know not we cook. You didn't cook. Watch and learn, bro. Oh, gosh. Watch yeah. and learn, my boy. I'm not going Watch and learn. Okay. <clears throat> Is it your phone? Watch and learn. <clears throat> hey, baby. You right? <laughs> yeah, I'm... Babe, I'm hungry. Like, see, I've no intent. Like, come on. Worthy, you are worthy. King of kings, Lord of lords, you are worthy, worthy, worthy. You are worthy, worthy, 
Almighty, King of kings, Lord of lords, I worship you. In Jesus' name we have worship. Amen. In Jesus' name we have worship. Amen. Amen. Now let us put that day into the hands of God. Pray, 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 pray. Amen. Put the thank day you, into Jesus, the hands of Father, God. Thank you, Lord, for making us the Because the Bible to said today. Thank you, Father, for that we wrestle God. not against flesh and blood, we'll give you, we'll give you but against thank principalities, you, against thank powers, you, Father. Thank you, Father. against thank you. rulers in high places. Thank you for today. Pray, pray. Because of today, it's not by my might, it's not by my power, but because of the grace that you have for me. Lord, I thank you for today. Thank you for the opportunity to be alive. Lord, I give you praise. I give you honor. I give you adoration because you are God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the gift of life. But I thank you for the opportunity to be alive today. It's not by my power. Thank you for the grace. Thank you for the grace. I give you the honor. I give you the adoration. I worship you. I give you adoration. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Father, I put my daughters into your hands. My sister's daughter and the one you have given me from my womb. Father, you have told me what to teach them and I have taught them. Father, I have placed them into your hands. As they go out each day, that thing that I did not imbibe in them, as they go out and they want to indulge in them, Father, in the name of Jesus, remove it from their hearts. Remove it from their hearts. Remove it from their hearts. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Anywhere they go to. And all these small, small boys with this sound up and down father block their ears Amen. father block their ears Amen. jehovah block their ears father as they go out let them come back in peace in your peace and take yo jay What's up? I'm stepping out. Where are you off to? Going to the supermarket. Uh. I'm going to buy a few things. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How do you want to go and see your mystery lover? Okay. What part of I'm going to pick up a thing or two, didn't you hear? Well, I don't believe you. That's your cup of tea. I'll be right back. Bro. Hey, Ron. Yeah. I'm curious about something. And what would that be? So, um, does love at first sight really happen? Love at first Wow. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fool. That guy's a love. Ah, Baba. You pay for this, trust me. Don't say she's a big cook, home cooked meal. Foodie. <laughs> Uh, good afternoon. Uh, the other day I came, there was uh, another girl here. Oh, that must have been Sandra. She's up duty today. Oh, I see, I see. Yes, so I'm, I'm looking for a customer I met here. Oh, do you have a name? What's her name? Oh, no, I don't I don't have a name, but uh, I, I can describe her. She is um, caramel skinned, um, medium height. Oh, sir, we have a lot of customers that are medium height. So if you have a name, maybe I will be able to assist you further. 
Of course. <laughs> what was I thinking? Yes, it's fine. So, are time. you not buying anything from us today? Oh. We have a lot of stuff you can get. Oh, I'll come back another time. All right, we'll look Thanks. forward to that. Sir. Yeah, Thank you. Sure. Bye. La 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 Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Forevermore the plan for today? What plan? I was about to ask you where you think you're going to dress up this morning. Hmm. I'm not doing anything today. Matter of fact, I'm having a lazy day. And I'm trying to look for this girl on Instagram. This beautiful girl I'm telling you about. She doesn't you? have Instagram or something. Hmm. You know what you need, my guy? What? You know what you need, my guy? What? You know what you need? You need Jesus. So Jesus can help me find this girl. Only Jesus can save you, bro. I'm serious. I can follow you to church. In fact, let me. I'm coming. Ah, uh Baba, -uh. you're taking this Jesus can save you too seriously. Of What's course. that? Yes, let me go take a shower. Are you being me. serious, though? Yes. Don't leave me alone. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. One thing we know for certain, and we are definitely about, is that God doesn't lie. And God will never change his mind. What God wants from you is just to play your part. And that promise will be fulfilled. Your salvation is of utmost importance to God. And that is why God gave you his only begotten son. That whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life. To welcome him. Take loss for the fact that the lost sheep is important and that is a key to repentance and your salvation. The father welcomed him. There was a big banquet and uh, everybody was happy and the guy was happy too. Praise God. Hallelujah. Now, uh, we call to mind the story of the prodigal son. He went to his father and said he wanted his chance. Of course, the father, and the little God we have, said, That was the girl outside. Is that her? Yes, no, that's her. I mean, I would that's never believe that I would see her in this kind of place. If you believe in Christ, um, what have you been looking for is right here. I swear. Thank God for Jesus. Are you crazy, guys? Church looks good. Yeah, that's good. So what, what are you going to do now? What? What are you going to do? Are you going to wait for after? Of Christ? course I'm going to wait right after the service. <laughs> <Love her boy. laughs> I mean, she's not going to sleep in church, is she? Yeah. So I guess I'll see you at home, yeah? 
Yeah, 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 definitely. Wish me luck. You'll forget about you. Well, maybe you should be trying this. What do you mean? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Of course, the father organized the banquet. Amen. Um, um, my please. I I I would have to go now. My, my cousin is waiting for me. She's been waiting for me actually. Okay. I thought she was going to wait a little longer. I thought so too, but I really do not want to keep her waiting. I'll finish up. Okay. Thank you. Hope you come to church for midweek service. Yes. Yes. I'll be here on Wednesday. Alright, see you. Bye. Bye. Are you done? Yes, let's go. Okay. Yes, he's a friend of mine. You know what? I'll, can you wait for me outside? I'll join you. Okay. Um, hi. Yes, can I help you? Uh, you? You do remember me, right? Am I supposed to? Can I get your number? Look, I, I mean you no harm, okay? But from the first day I bumped into you at the supermarket, I knew instantly that I wanted to see you again. Please, I can't give you my number. And if that would be all, I'd love to be on my way. Wait, wait, okay. I am kind of new in this area. And I was just hoping that I could make new friends. And if that friend would be you, then it would be an honor. Look, um... Aaron, Aaron is my name. Aaron. Yes. Aaron, I'm not allowed to have friends. I am. I'm not allowed to give out my number either. So please, I would love to be on my way. Okay. Now. Listen, just <laughs> hear me out, okay? If, if I am to ascribe coming here today and meeting you, I would call it fate. Because I never expected to see you here. My friend Jamal said, Jesus can do anything. And I guess Jesus really can do anything. I mean, you, you feel what I feel too, right? What's the name? My name is Soma. Soma. Beautiful name. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> well, I guess Jesus can do anything. This is Jamal's Jesus. Such a great guy, huh? Soma! So, Ma! Auntie, I'm coming, I'm coming. Please, please just give me a minute. I'll join you soon, okay? I'm so sorry. Join you shortly. Look at this children. I don't know what she has been doing since she woke up. Everything. Slow, 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 slow. Look at this. She make me go late. Hello? Auntie, I'm ready. Mm -hmm. Hello? 
Hello? Yeah, I'm okay. Um, can I call you back? I'm going on with my aunts right now. Okay, God bless you. Who was that? Um, my friend. Is everything okay? Y yes, and see everything. Everything is fine. We can go now. All right then. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hello? Hi, Aaron. Yeah, I just finished classes, heading back home now. Can't we have this conversation when I get home? No, I'm not smiling. <laughs> okay, fine. Just one question. Just ask your question already. I understand. But you see, and the fact that Jesus died for you on the cross, I mean, it's enough sacrifice. Just think about the overwhelming love, the, the selflessness. <laughs> Humans, you can never please them. You know, I just pray the Holy Spirit convicts you because he's the only person that softens stony hearts. Yes, it's, 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 it's rock hard. Okay. Yeah, me too. I have to go anyway. Bye. Hmm. That smile looks suspicious. Madam, is dinner ready? I don't understand. Whose turn is it to make dinner? I don't care. Didn't you get home before me? So? Love, see this thing you're doing here? It's Junior Bella's wickedness. It's very wicked. Oh, My friend, go and cook. Oh, cool. And please, mom, move no me back. Please, let the food be sweet. Thank you. Yes. No, what I was trying to say. No. You know that God loves you, right? So that is what I... <laughs> Would you let me talk? Would you let me finish? <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, um, yes, the Lord be with you. Yeah. Good evening, Mama. I swear, you won't believe what just happened to me. My auntie almost caught me talking to you. <laughs> she would have had my head, I swear. <laughs> But to be honest, Aaron, it's, it's really amazing talking to you. Well, that's all I have to offer. Friendship, nothing more. Because the Bible says... Come on, Soma. Let's not go that route. Every time I talk to you, I feel alive. Like a part of me has been missing. But it has finally been found. Whenever you say things like this, I just get shy and speechless. <laughs> shy is good. It shows me how real and how genuine-hearted you are. All I am asking is 30 minutes of my friend's time. If I had other friends, maybe I wouldn't have been so desperate. But you are literally all that I have. Please. Aaron, I don't know. Her auntie would kill me if she finds out. How is she going to know? I won't tell her. She will. And if tomorrow won't work, I can come pick you up from school. And have you... Home before she returns by 8 p.m. on Monday. Wait, how do you know when she gets back? <laughs> I'm an intentional man, so uh, there's nothing you've told me about yourself that I cannot remember. Nah, I don't believe that. <laughs> you live with your aunt and cousin, 
You were born December 3rd at JK Hospital, Patakot. Your aunt turned 42 on the 5th of March. Love attends Georgetown University and loves to sing. Your favorite color is white because you relate to its purity. You love God and you idolize your aunt because of how much she loves God too. I don't idolize my auntie. I just meant she's your role model, someone you really look up to and want to be like. Wow. You're actually a good listener. Soma, I love you so much. I find myself hanging on to every syllable that comes from your beautiful lips. I would do anything, anything to see you. Okay, fine. I'll see what I can do. I'll take care, okay? How far now? How far? Um, look, there's this friend of mine. I need to see. He needs my help. Which friend is that? Um, you know him now? The one from church, the guy we saw that day. I remember I saw you with a guy, but I can't remember his face particularly. Okay. But the guy from church. So why are you going to see him? Why are you going? What does he need you for? Um, he, he, was, he wasn't clear. He was vague. Well, it's, it's very urgent and I really need to go help him. Okay, so you need me to come with you? No, 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 no. I, I'm, you don't have to come with me. I won't even take time to help. It's just, you know, just fast. I just wanted you to know. I thought to inform you before I go and I'll also find a way to talk to Auntie about it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Hi. You will not believe what happened today. What happened? Hmm. Mommy almost caught me with Jonathan. It's a lie. No jokes. How? We're standing in front of his house, right? If I thank God he saw mommy's car, you need to see the way I ducked. <laughs> hey. You're lucky. <laughs> Your picture would have been plastered everywhere. It'll be try. Gone too soon. <laughs> Fornicator makes her way to a master. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, 100. Mm. Well, you know that. You know that, mommy. My auntie, your mom, actually means well. Okay. By being overprotective of us because of our faith walk and, you know. Mm. Thank you. I get, I get. Mm. What is, you're already blushing for this place I'm going to. Are you sure? I'm coming. Hey. Hey. Please uh, come in. Thank you. Yeah. Um. You can sit. Thank you. Yes. <sighs> welcome, welcome. Uh, what can I offer you? Water is fine. Thank you. Water? I have juice. Juice will be fine. <sighs> okay. Okay. Make yourself comfortable, I'll be right back. Okay? Here we are. So you can have this. Thank you. Sorry, I had to multitask with my hands. Uh, oh. oh, sorry, let me help you. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Yeah, it's really good to have you here. Thank you. Your house is really nice. Do you live alone? Oh, actually, it's not my house. It's one of my father's houses. Um, it's actually used as an Airbnb. But since I'm around for now, I'm occupying it. Oh, it's, it's beautiful. Thank you. You are beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. What? Nothing. I, I'm just in awe of how much peace your presence carries. It's, it's, it's wonderful. 
The thing about you is, you look more beautiful when you laugh. I mean, I have never met a human being with so much peace. I never thought it was, you know, possible. But with you, I think I have a better perspective and a change of narrative. Thank you. Yeah. Mm. What are you doing? Come on, so why you ask too much questions? Just open your mouth. <laughs> oh, I think you've got something on your... What are you trying to do? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what came of me. Hey, well, why would you even think of doing something like that? How would you want me to sin against God? Okay, relax. Sin against God. What do you... We, we haven't even done anything yet. Yet. Aaron, I am not going to do anything with you. I wasn't brought up that way. Neither am I one of those girls that believe sex is nothing but a handshake. I'll have you know that my body is the temple of God. And I'm going to keep myself till marriage. Okay. So marry me then. It's all a joke to you, right? I mean, <laughs> I really love you. And yes, if it comes to it, I'd gladly marry you. It's an idea that I would beautifully embrace. Why? I want my kids to look like you, to have your beautiful eyes, to have your smile, to have your naturally pouted lips. That's, that's what I want. I want to sleep every night and wake up every morning next to you. I'm head over heels in love with you and I can't help it. I know what you're thinking. I mean, there's a bad boy, probably takes advantage of girls and all that, but that's not what this is. I... I love you. I feel deeply for you. And I don't want to run away from it. I want to embrace it. And I know you feel the same way too. Right? Let's embrace it. Okay? Father, please forgive me for allowing my flesh rule over me. Why did I allow myself to go the way I did? Why didn't I fight off the temptation harder? I mean, even the Bible says, flee. How could I have put myself in a position to be lured? How can I have allowed myself to be this weak? God, I'm sorry. Bruh. She was a virgin. I was surprised. Really, I never told girls like her still exist. You know how those churchgoers are? 
they, they say something and then act a certain way that contradicts what they say. And, and, but, huh. She seemed to be really into God and I was just amazed. And you went ahead to this virgin now. Huh? Oh, please save me the sermon, Sky. Stop with this holy head and our attitude. Bro, serious matter. But uh, I noticed something. When the whole thing was done, she became kind of moody, like she was sad. Mm. Yeah, like she was disappointed in herself. Maybe she felt like she let herself on too easy. Or maybe I applied too much pressure. I, I don't. I don't know. You think I did? Maybe you did. I don't know. Did you? No, no, no. What? Okay. I I need to see her again. Yeah, but but what if she doesn't want to see me? Come on, you don't make me fall in love. Look, I don't even know how, but uh, I I want to keep her. Like, uh, uh. yes, this girl is beautiful, inside out, and now that I've had her. I don't want to lose her. Like I, I, I want to marry her. She's the kind of girl you wife. Oh my, you don't make me fall in love, bro. What has she done to you? This is from the small basket. Summer. Summer. Is everything okay? Is it school? Is it family? You can talk to me. I, I don't know if God can ever forgive me. The Bible says that if we come to him with a contrary heart, he is ever merciful to forgive us. So what did you do? I, I, I cheated. I cheated in a test. <laughs> Soma, God has forgiven you. So long as you've prayed to him, you've asked him for forgiveness. Okay? If only you knew I cheated with my flesh. I failed God's test. You don't understand. There is nothing to understand. Our God is a merciful God. It is well with you, okay? So now, you record. <sighs> so, Ma, you record. It is well. Um, hello, ladies. Is that not your friend? L late? Not anymore. Huh? Uh, sorry. Please wait, wait. Yeah, hello, Soma. Like half an hour.
Så mig. Hvad? If you're ever in trouble, who would you go to? Trouble? You heard me the first time. I'll, I'll, I'll go to God and see how he can help me solve it. And you? Uh, uh, mommy, I'll go to God. Mm. Yes, mommy. Take. What? Take. Mm. You know how to use it, right? No, ma, I don't. But you know how to sleep with men. I I don't know what you are talking about, Auntie. It means your pregnancy is an immaculate conception. No, let me rephrase. You were touched by the Holy Ghost. Uh, mommy, no. Uh, no, she's not pregnant. Mommy, we both saw our period almost the same time last month. Will you shut up? Do you know how old I am? And how many births I've witnessed? Even they have only birthed than just you. Now, get up, go in there, and take the test. Auntie. I said get up and go and take the test. And you, hmm? prepare to take your own test. I'm not, I'm not pregnant too. I'm not pregnant. I, I'm not pregnant. I'm not pregnant. You're not pregnant. But we need to be sure. Auntie. Auntie, please. Please, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I don't know how it happened. Please. Please, I beg you, please. So, my why? I did my best to raise you in the ways of the Lord. Yes, yes, you did, you did. I taught you how your body is a living sacrifice unto the Lord. So, my. Uh, see, I did not mean to ask, but it was a mistake. Why? Mommy, welcome. It was, it was a mistake. I'm sorry. Please forgive me, please. It was a mistake. Uh, uh, someone should talk to me. What's going on here? She's pregnant. <laughs> That's not possible, Mom. Um, We saw our period. So for last one, right? Yeah. yeah, so doctor said it's different for different bodies. Yeah. Where did I go wrong? Please, it was an accident. <coughs> Mom, it was not intentional. Mom, please, forgive her. <laughs> I'm sorry, she got me to it was an accident. Don't please let your grace be for me. Do not don't it's my flesh. Let my flesh take over, Lord. Sorry, Lord, forgive me. Please give me another chance.
tapi gak bisa I'm fine How are you? I'm fine Are you sure? So no hello for mommy? <sighs> mommy, I'm so sorry How are you doing mommy? I'm fine, how was the journey? <laughs> fine mommy So, how is my little princess doing? Oh, She's showing me Pepe She's a correct girl do not stop giving her troubles, okay? Okay? <laughs> so, how are you? That's unfaithful. Have you been eating? Jesus! Mom, what is it? My shop! My shop is burning! Eh? Jesus. My shop is on fire! How? My shop is on fire! How, Mom? Wait, that drop the curtains. Where's the car key? Get my car keys for me! Where's your mommy's car key? How? Your phone! <laughs> Mommy, please calm down, okay? Everything is going to be fine. Okay, God allowed this happen for a reason, I believe. Okay? We lost everything. Every single thing, we lost everything. Mommy, please calm down. What are we going to do? Where am I going to start from? Auntie. Where am I going to start from? Auntie, please. Auntie, please, it's okay. <coughs> Auntie, Love and I, Love and I will do something. We'll, we'll get jobs to support, do anything. Me and you will get jobs. <laughs> Auntie, you're going to be fine. We are going to be okay. Please, I, I don't want you to cry, please. <laughs> Mommy breaks me to see you cry, you know, right? You know, right? Wait till you do that place. What's that plate now? Nah? You never finish that place, it's down there. Ah, wow, what's plate? Ma, ma, please, anything. I can do anything. I will do anything at all. Oh, see, walk with the year, what I feel give you now, eh? Now, for a strong person, person will go feel better. I don't forgive you. I can bend. I'm very strong. Uh, <laughs> see, eh? You are heavily pregnant. Like this. Me, I be woman. I don't forgive you that work. If anything happened to you, what thing I will do? Eh? What thing I will tell people? Eh? I don't feel forgive myself. I get conscience. I beg. No vets. Yeah? If not, what thing I will feel, I will give you. Yeah? Okay, thank you, ma'am. Sorry. Small, small. Try. Hey, hey, wait till the... You don't give her food. Yeah, eh? Say I sit that here, you don't give her anything. Yeah, I don't know why she waits there. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon. Um, please, ma, I'm looking for a job. A job? What kind of job? Um, I can help you do anything. Anything at all. Can you braid her? No, ma. What about Nari with windows all back? No, I can't. I can't do that one, but I, I can help you um, go on errands, pick anything, maybe tell me to... Um, um, sweep, just maybe send me a message. I can buy you anything, food. With this your condition like this? Ah, I'm strong, girls. You can't braid hair. You can't do even ordinary weaving. There's no place for you here, and I'm sorry. I can't even employ you like this. With this your condition, going on errand. I'm sorry, I can't do that. I'm sorry. Please hold on. Please. Your transport. Sorry. Thank you, ma. You're welcome. Where are you now? Where are you? I have to leave the house completely. I'm outside in front of the street. Good afternoon. I'm in front of... How are you, my dear? Sorry, my name is Sonia. Okay. And 
Yes. Um, I can do anything. I can cook. I can clean. I can. I don't know if you have. It's it's fine. It's fine. I'm actually washing out now. I'm waiting for someone. You can see me trying to direct someone. So come back here twelve noon tomorrow. Tell the security people that you want to see the lady. You know who was standing as at eight twenty five. All right. I could have Thank a job you. for you. All right. All right. Take care of yourself. Okay. All right. Well, okay. girl. I don't know what else to do. If I show me Pepe, ah. I think it's time for us to face our new reality. Broke. We are broke. Auntie, we are please. Broke. Auntie, please don't be sad, okay? Don't cry. <clears throat> I promise we will do whatever it takes to support you. Oh. Yes, mommy. Mm -hmm. See. Everything is going to be fine, okay? Let's just put our trust in God, okay? Mommy, it's okay. You know what? I'll be back shortly. Where are you going? Let's look for a job. A job? Who is going to employ you in this condition? I don't know. But I'm not going to spend the rest of my life wondering. I'm not going to spend the rest of my life dwelling on my problems when I can come up with solutions. In this, your delicate condition, you want to go job hunting. You're not going anywhere. Ha. Do you know I'm pregnant and we're expecting the baby very soon? How are we going to survive? I don't want to be a burden to you. Auntie, I know that if you could do something, if you could take care of us right now, I know you would. But right now, this is our reality. I need to go out there and get a job. We can only trust God to provide a job for me. You know what? I'll see you guys. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yes, be right back. Not going far. Let me go and wash the dirty dishes in the kitchen. What did you say is your name again? My name is Soma, Ma. Where are you from? From Abia State, Ma. You said you want to work. Yes, ma, I can actually do anything. I can cook, clean, wash your car, go on errands, anything at all, any work. You know, if you want food, I, I can actually give you food and you'll be on your way. Oh, no, no, ma, I, I, I don't want food. I, I really want to work. Please, please, ma. Okay, you're, you're very lucky I'm actually looking for a house manager. Um, part of your work, apart from cooking, cleaning, you will also serve, you will serve the security man and the driver inclusive. Um, okay. Um, you can stay here if you want to. We have accommodation and if you want to come from home, we will, you will resume by 8 o'clock and then you'll leave by 5 p.m. <sighs> Understood, ma. I really do not mind the accommodation though. Okay. All right. So let me show you to your quarters. Thank you so much. Ma. You're also very lucky. I made some pepper chili fries. <laughs> Thank you, ma. All right. Thank you. Ma. Oh, bless okay. you. Yeah, come in.
Summer, where, 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 have, where have you been? I've, I've, I was trying to reach you. I've, I, I was trying to call you. I was looking for you. Where have you been? Summer, where you been? Summer, Summer, wait! Summer. Son? What's uh, the problem? Uh, Mom, you said? Um, well, you were chasing after her. Her? I, uh, oh. Uh, she. She looks like uh, someone I, I, I know, but. Uh, never mind. Come and eat your food, please. No, Mom, actually, I think I left my phone upstairs. So let me just go get it. I'll be right back, okay? Uh, okay. All right. even spend 24 hours here and now this happens. Oh God, what kind of test is this now? Is this some kind of test? God, why does my life have to be like this? I thought you were good. Hello? Hey Jamal, how far now? You will not believe it. Guess who I just saw? Who? Soma now, my wife. Your wife? Aaron, when did you walk down the aisle and who was your best man? Guy, I'm serious. I, I'm telling you, I just saw Soma <laughs> now. Okay, seriously though, how? <sighs> you think, guy? It's God who. She's not working for my mom. Hmm, interesting. Have you spoken to her? Lord, Lord, please, if this is some kind of temptation, let it it's pass over me because this, this guy is temptation. I don't want to sin against you again. God, please. Not this time. It's not a good time. Lord, help me. Is that my baby? Excuse me? Soma, if this is my baby, I deserve to know. I deserve to be involved in its life. I told you I was going to be there for you every step of the way and I still mean it. Please. Why won't you just tell me? Tell me, please. You just ghosted me like that. It's not right. Is it my baby? So, so it's... So it's, it's, it's not my baby. Really? So after everything we shared... So my, you, you could you could open your legs for another man. After everything we've shared, you didn't even want me to touch you. So I'm surprised that you will let another man go in between your legs. That's not right. Are you that cheap? I will not let you disrespect me like that, Aaron. Why would you even think so low of me? Think I'll just let any man get into my pants? For your information, I do not sleep around. Excuse me. So, 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 so it's my baby. It's my baby. Um. Yes, uh, so, so, mom, there's a, a friend of mine who thinks he got a girl pregnant. <coughs> Are you okay? Are you sure? Yes. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I think. 
<coughs> Sorry. Okay. Yes, I was listening to you, dear. So, um, uh, what I was saying is that there's. <coughs> Do you need water? Excuse me, my. I... No, 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 no. You can go. You can go. <coughs> Is she okay? Yes, yeah, she looks fine to me. Okay, you know, her condition also. Mm, yeah, I guess. Okay, so you were saying something? Yes, there's uh, a friend of mine. Okay. He thinks he he got a girl pregnant. Hmm. He thinks? Yes. Okay. Alright, I'm listening. And uh, he, he doesn't know what... He's do. not sure. Yes, yeah, exactly. That's the word. He's not so so sure about it. Why won't you tell me? Aaron, Why? Aaron, because there's nothing to tell. Look, I'm here to work and I love my job very much. So please leave me alone. What are you doing? I just want to see if the connection is still there. Let me go. Let me go! Soma, I love you. Just, Soma. I saw Iran today. Where? Where I work. No way. I'm actually very serious. He happens to be the son of my new employer. What are the odds? God. What are the chances? Destiny really has both of you on a timeline. Have you guys talked? No, there's nothing to say to him. Besides, the Bible says resist temptation and it would flee. The same Bible says wisdom is profitable to direct. Has it said anything at all? No, he's willing to marry me and do right by me. So why haven't you just tell him that the child is his? Why are you stunning? Well, because he's bad for me. He's everything I do not want to be unequally yoked with. You know, I think I'll just come home. I think I'll just quit this job and, and come home. He will never see me again. Hmm. Are you good? Oh, yes, I am perfect. Just waiting for the food. Mm-hmm. Oh. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Oh, don't worry, I can help with that. That's fine. Son? Yes, Mom? We do not frolic with the house helps. Well, I wasn't fr I just wanted to, you know, help her so she can go back in. I see. Ah, oh, good. Okay. Where are you going? To call Aaron for dinner, ma. Um, listen to me. From today henceforth, you will not call my son again for anything. I will be the one to go call him to come eat. You are working for me and me alone. Is that understood? Yes, ma'am. Good. So go do other things. I will call him by myself. Okay, ma'am. Shuma, why are you avoiding me? Why are you trying to deny our child the presence of a father? Why? Many girls who, who are in your position will when they get married so they don't become single parents. Aaron, I am not many girls. So I guess it's 
I guess it's me then. It's me because I'm not righteous. I, I'm ungodly. That's it. How did you hear that? What are the odds? God, what are the chances? Destiny really has both of you on its timeline. Have you guys talked? No, there's nothing to say to him. Besides, the Bible says resist temptation and it would flee. The same Bible says wisdom is profitable to direct. Has he said anything at all? No, well, he's willing to marry me and do right by me. So why haven't you just tell him that the child is his? Why are you stunning? Well, because he's bad for me. He's everything I do not want to be unequally yoked with. Summer, if this child is mine, then I demand to be in its life. I want to be in your life too. Even if you don't want me to be in yours, I, but I will want to be in yours. I will want to be here for you and our baby. Whatever it is, I, I could talk to my parents and we'll find a way to take care of the child. And I'll give you time to think about it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I could say as many times as possible until I probably sound like a broken record. But I never meant to make you compromise your faith in God. I never meant to make your life turn out this way. I promise you. I let you slip away once. But now that I've found you, I will not let you go again. Let her go. Mom? Let her go! Let her go! Listen to me. We're going to stand by her, provide everything that she needs, even after the baby is born. But that is only if we confirm through a DNA test that you are really the father of that child. I am her first. So? Who says because you're her first that you're the only one that she's been with? Listen to me, Aaron. I don't know what is wrong with you. You have a very bright future ahead of you. Why do you want to jeopardize it with this girl who doesn't even measure up? Do you even care about my feelings, Mom? That's the only girl I've ever loved. Oh my goodness, do you even know anything about love? Do you? Listen, you are not going to marry this girl. I reject it, I refuse it, I forbid it. It's not going to happen. End of discussion. You cannot forbid me, mom. I'm a grown man and I am capable of making my own decisions. I love that girl with all my heart. And I'm going to be with her. It's just, I thought you of all people would understand. <sighs> Aaron, listen to me. I refuse to understand. Do you get me? I'm not going to sit by here and watch you smear our name with mud. For crying out loud, Aaron. You couldn't even choose anyone from our class or maybe slightly lower. Do you really have to go to the bottom of the barrel? Enough, mom. Enough. That girl you are calling the bottom of the barrel is carrying my child. Your grandchild. Excuse me, mom. You will not speak to me in that manner. Aaron? Oh, hey, mom. Yes, dear. How are you? Good. Mwah. How's your outing? Good. See, you're still watching your favorite ah, program. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Let me change. I'm coming. All right. Summer. So, mom. Mm hmm I can't seem to find Summer anywhere in this house. Where is she? Oh. That girl, you can't believe it. What? She just picked her things and left. Humans. 
Mom, are you, are you sure she just picked her things and left? Because that's very unlike Summer. Positive. She packed her things and she left. You didn't chase her out? Really? Aaron, please. I don't want to miss this part of this movie. Mom, if I find out that you chased her out, I will leave this house. And I'm going to look for her right now. So. Summer? Where have you been? Summer, what did I do to you? What have I ever done that is so unforgivable? Why do I have to go through so much torture? Why do I have to look for you to the ends of the earth? Why? You should already know by now, no matter where you go, no matter what city we run to, we would always find a way back to each other. This is fate. What well, fate ordained, Summer? You're my soulmate. It's, it's time we embraced it and stopped running away from it. I see you've given bed. Where, where's our child? Home with my friend. Can I... Can I meet the baby? Thank you. Don't thank me. Your father, it's your right. Hey, baby. Dad is here. And I promise I'm not going nowhere. I'm never going to leave your side again. Yeah? So you're here for work, eh? Oh, yes, yes, I am. What a coincidence. Let's get married. In court. What about your mom? When we get there, we'll handle it. You know she's against us getting married, right? But I don't want anyone to come in between you and I. I don't want anything to come in between you and your mom. Nothing will come in between us. Right now, I just want to focus on you. And our baby, she'll come around. Okay. She looks just like me. Ah, please. <laughs> so, <clears throat> haven't you been curious as to if I'm dating anyone presently? Nope. But I want you to ask me. I really don't want to. I'd rather not. Ah. But I'm willing to tell you. Erin, I really don't want to know. Come on. Go ahead. Ask. Okay, fine. Um, Erin, how many women have you dated? Well, no one. No Not because I lacked anything, but uh, I just, I couldn't find you in anyone. You really did something to me. I did, I, I did not do anything. Yes, you. you did. You imprinted on me. I kept looking for Soma in every girl I met. 
your smile, that little pout on your lips when your body get mad at me. So you've been looking for me in every woman. How many women have you tried to date? Hmm? Let's say 40, 50, 100. Iran? <laughs> well, I really can't remember. That's how insignificant they are to me. All right, I I really want to be here for you and our baby. First things first, we would have to move out of this place. First things first, I'm going to lead you to Christ. Right now? Yes. Okay. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. Oh, Jesus. Lord Jesus. La, 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 I come to you. La, 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 la. Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Forevermore. Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Will you be mine? Forevermore. So tell me, how does it feel like to be my wife? <laughs> you remember the first time you came to my house? You're like, How is it? you have to marry me, and now you're my wife. So what do you have to say? <laughs> it feels like, like I'm where I'm supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Feels like I'm home. Yeah. But there's something you must do first. Auntie. I swear I did not mean to run away from home. I shouldn't have. Please. I'm very sorry. Please forgive me. So you're married now? Yes, auntie. And I, Aaron and I, we, we promise to do better moving forward. The Bible says, he who finds a wife finds a good thing and will obtain favor from the Lord. So mama, do bigger. You're a good thing. For that, your home is blessed. Amen. Baby. This baby shall be an arrow in your hands. Amen. And not an arrow onto your heart. Amen. <sighs> Look at her looking like my, my sister. <laughs> I can see that. too. <laughs> I do look so much like my sister. Mm. Aaron, you do not take my calls or reply my messages. Where have you been? I'm sorry, Mom. This is so unlike you and I have been so worried. When are you coming to see me? Um, <clears throat> I'm, I'm married, Mom. You're married? To who? To, to summer. That will be over my dead body. Mom, I'm serious. We got married in court last week. Aaron, you defy me. Mom, why can't you just see that I love her? Why? Hello? He Hello, Mom? Hey, hey, babe, babe. Don't get yourself worked up, okay? Everything will be all right. Hmm? Come here, come here. <sighs> yeah, what's your charge for 20,000? 500. 
All right, let me have it. Ah, uh, decline. So what do you mean? Try it again, try it again. Very dissenting and decline. It's not possible now. Okay, check this. Check this other one. Okay. Happy. You know, sometimes this network. Sometimes. Ah. The same thing. Decline. Declined? What do you even mean? So as my account manager, you're telling me you cannot unfreeze my account? For crying out loud, that's my mom and I am her only son. Why would she do that to me? Why? Why would she cut me off? Hello? What are we going to do now? Um, she cut me off. But hey, it will be fine, okay? I promise you, I'll drive a cab if I have to. I'll clean the gutters if I have to. But we wouldn't like anything, okay? Trust me. to die. I've seen God do miracles. What of if he chooses not to help? I suggest you call your son and make peace with him so that your soul can find rest. He said he has a child. Six months seems to be a short period of time. But it is long enough to make memory that you take to heaven. I would like to be on my way and I record us to come and attend to you. All right. Thank you, Doctor. So about work today, I met a lady. Another one? What was she offering you this time? Sex or a job? Is it because I tell you these things? I'm just asking. Well, she didn't offer me a job in exchange for sex. She gave me her card. So why haven't you called her? It's late. I can't be calling her right now. Yeah, it's just 10 p.m. I'm sure she would still be awake. She's late last Uh huh. Call her. Okay. Women and their suspicions. Speaker. Put it on speaker. It's ringing. Hello. Yeah, hello. Um, good evening, Ma. Sorry, I'm calling so late. I actually just got back home now. Who is this? The guy you gave your card today and I asked to call you. Oh, Mr. Ansel. Nice of you to have called. I've been waiting. 
Do you mind we sit tomorrow so we can talk? At your office? Oh no, I won't be in the office tomorrow. I'll be at the hospital. Beep. No, you're not going. You're not going. Don't worry. God will send you a man. A man that will help you. That's a woman. Wait, really? Let me discard. Throw it away. In fact, you know what? Send me delete her number. Babe. In fact, I need to block her number. That's you know I like when you're jealous. Come here. No <laughs> job. Babe, your phone is ringing. Babe, your phone. Babe, pick it up. I'm coming out soon. Who is it? My what? My what? I'm taking all the drugs and just going to super spy. Mr. Mr. What are you doing here? Leave my room this minute. If she leaves, I leave too. Get out of this place. Please, Ma. Kindly wait outside. I beg you. Doctor, didn't you hear what I said? I said if she goes, I'm going with her. <laughs> no. Mr. Aron, your mother is dying. If I were you, I would rather lose the battle so as to win the war. What are, what are, you, what are you talking about? She told me she was critically ill. Why, why, what, what's all this? What's, what's all this? She's dying. News. I, I don't understand. She has cancer. If I were you, I will make all memory count. Is it true? Here. Mm. Oh. Yeah, sit up. Let me help you. Mm. Take it easy.
Mom, you need to eat. You need your strength. I don't feel like eating anything. Where is my girl? Okay, just one bite. And I promise you I'll go bring her. She's, she's just outside, she's playing with the nurse. Hungry. Me. One um, bite, please. <sighs> All right. We'll get back to this. <laughs> Sleeping. Oh. oh, oh, my goodness. <laughs> she looks so much like you. Yeah, she wants to. Come, come, come on, darling. No, 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 no. Oh, my Grandma's here. No crying. She looks very much like you. Yes, she does. Mom, I'm sorry. I'm sorry we didn't. That we got married without, without telling you. But I'll do it over and over again if I have to. And if I can turn the hands of time. Samara is, she's a special human being. She makes me the happiest man. With her, I am the best version of myself. Getting married to her mom, was the best decision I've ever made in my life. And I'm sorry. Forgive us, please, Mom. And just take her in as your daughter. I, I beg you. I don't have strength to pull you up. I'm sorry too. I'm very, very sorry. I should have handled it better. I'm sorry. I'm you, Mom. I'm you.
babe 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 You're here, dear. Yes. Um, are you ready to eat? Should I give you your food now? Ah, not yet. Sit down. Okay. Hmm. There's something I would like to share with you. When I was a much more younger woman, trying to navigate through life, we were thought never to look down on anyone irrespective of the class that they belong to. You know why? Because you never can tell where your blessings are coming from. You do not know who God will use to bless you. God, I would have used my hand to abort my own blessings 
I would have literally chased my God-given miracle out of my life in the name of class. My dear, I am so sorry about the way I treated you. I want to thank you for praying for me every <sighs> single night for three solid weeks. Oh, you do not want to know the peace those prayers brought to me. Look at me. All of a sudden, strength started coming to my body. I felt life coming back to me. Life literally seeped into my bones. Thank you so much. Because of your prayers, I'm alive, I'm healthy, I'm well. God bless you, my oh, dear. Mommy, please, please. And please forgive me for every single thing I did to you. I'm sorry about the way I treated you. Okay? Please, I had no hand in it. It was all God. Well, on the contrary, my love, it was your prayers. So, thank you. Thank you for allowing yourself. Because once you started praying for my mom, I began to notice a change in her, and I can testify to that. Indeed, your God is a life giver and a situation changer. I'm beginning to believe. Oh, thank God you, Jesus. Amazing. Thank you, Jesus. Mommy, I'm so glad you're getting better. Yes, yes, yes. Feel <sighs> very strong. But we still need to invite the doctor to come run some tests so we can have concrete evidence of what God has done. Oh, sure. Mm -hmm. Sure. Thank you, my darling. You're welcome. Mommy, you know one thing? One thing you must know is that there's nothing, there's no situation that God cannot turn around. I believe, I believe, I believe. Madam, this is amazing. This is really a shock on my part. Wow. I went through your biases several times. To my greatest surprise, no cancer cell was found. Yes. Oh my goodness! <sighs> Madam, you are as fit as a horse. Thank you so much, Doctor. Thank you. Go and enjoy your new life. Oh, thank you, Lord. You're welcome. Thank you so much, Doctor. God You're bless welcome. you. All right. Oh my God! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, God. Babe? Aaron! Hey. Yeah, babe, what? Why are you breathing heavy? Aaron. Yeah? I got the admission. You did? Yes! You did? Yes. No way. How? <laughs> Wait, let me read it. You have just been offered admission in. Oh, my <laughs> Lord. <laughs> you see, baby, I told you. I told you you did it. I told you we're gonna make it. Yes, you did. Thank you so much for everything. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Come on. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you know what? We're gonna celebrate. We're gonna be grateful. And we're gonna pray. In Jesus' name. Tell all we thank you for our lives. Thank you for family. I thank you for my baby here. <laughs> I thank you for everything that you've done. We're grateful. We love you. We appreciate you. And we say, Amen. Will you be amen. Mine? <laughs> Will you be mine forevermore?
mistakes may help Temptations may arise